Hi. Hi, Ashley. How's it going? How are you? Good. Good. Thank you. Fashion, I like the hair. It's cut a little bit. It's a little different, but it's still a vibe. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I'm going to start with you. You play Warren, a member of The Six and Daisy Jones and The Six, uh, which is not a real band, but it was inspired by Fleetwood Mac. Were you at all a fan of Fleetwood Mac before taking on this role? No, not at all. I, I actually, I didn't listen to very much rock growing up at all. I, I, I mean, like when I think of the 70s, I think disco, funk, Latin music is mostly what I grew up with. Um, and so Fleetwood Mac was not really, you know, I knew the songs, but I just didn't really know the band that well. I think that the show is inspired very clearly by Fleetwood Mac, but also we draw a lot from a lot of different sources. So So it's not just like a fictionalized account of them, but more like just a whole new story in and of itself. Um, yeah. And Josh, you actually played guitar. So you knew you were familiar with playing guitar. Um, talk to us about what went into the transformation though, because what we see play out on screen is this, you know, it looks like you guys are like a real band in the seventies. Like the chemistry is there, everything, you guys are hitting your mark. Talk to us about what went into uh, making you all look believable as a band on screen. I mean, so much went into it. It's kind of insane, really. I mean, we were originally only supposed to have three months of prep. Um, I mean, I'm a guitarist in life, but in the show I'm playing bass, uh, which similar to my character, you know, he starts as a guitarist and is asked to play bass. Mm -hmm. um, but in terms of that prep, you know, I hadn't really spent a great deal of time really truly crafting my ability to play the bass. And, and uh, you know, I had some familiarity with it, but we had band camp for three months. Uh, and, and at first we were working on our own with tutors, like really working through the songs because we couldn't play together yet. And then the pandemic hit and we ended up having a year and a half off where we were uh, still staying in touch with our, our coaches. We were get, staying in touch with each other on, on Zoom uh, regularly. And then uh, we came back from the pandemic and had another three months of band camp. Uh, and at this point, it's like we'd had by that point, almost two years of, uh, of practicing the songs on our own. Right. So we were able to come back for this three months, so lucky, you know, to have yeah. this time, but three months then coming back just before we started filming where we could actually get on a stage together and play as a band. So it, by that point, you know, we'd been friends and comrades for, you know, almost two years. And to have that kind of build up and support network from everybody that was running the show um, and such a carefully orchestrated TV show. Uh, I think there was just so many factors that added into the authenticity that came through in the end product. I'm telling you, you guys like knock it out of the park. Sebastian, <laughs> sex, drugs and rock and roll, right? In the seventies. Talk to us about what the overall theme though is of this series, Daisy Jones and the Six. What is the well, theme and message here? I mean, I, I think that it's rare that you come across a show that is so all-encompassing, you know? Like, I've never played a character that you see from when he's 12 years old until he's 50, you know? Like, you really see, like, our whole lives as they play out. And it's, um, you know, so so it's hard to, to, like, there's a lot, there's just so many things. Like, especially from the beginning of the show, where, like, a bunch of kids, like, trying to make it big. In the end of the show, like, we're the biggest band and, like, everything's falling apart. Like, we're shooting a, a bunch of different kinds of shows at once. Um, so I think that like, you know, the thing that people would take away from this is just really getting to know each and every one of us and, and feeling like, like I'm a fan of, of the band almost that like, you feel like it's a real thing that you've been through with us, you know?